Hello. Hi there. This is Dr. Frank Alpia, a researcher at King's College. Uh, today, 20th of August 2021, I present to you robotic entertainment. Uh, yeah, entertainment is to consider an idea or feeling and allow it to develop in the mind. Robotics uh, is a design, construction, operation and a use of robotic, robot machine. Uh, the services of robotics, ICS, indicates mathematics, precisely kinematics. Next slide. Now the question I ask is, what is the focus? Is it design, construction, or operation of a robot? Next slide. I now define robotic entertainment. Robotic entertainment. Robotic entertainment is design, development of robotic idea, robot idea, or robot feeling in the mind with art forms captured by photography or virtual reality means. It is about autonomous program behavior for film or movie purposes. Subject matter. On this slide, the subject matter here uh, concerns the determinant of autonomous systems, art forms, the activity of creating or stating these subjects in digital scale, and not all scientific. It is our robotic art, uh, the subject matter on the fourth bullet, it is about art and determinant with robot presence. Next slide. It is about attraction of robots in its promise of arm manipulation. It is about robotic arm system consisting of robot base, links, joints, motors or actuators, joint sensors and ends effectors in the tax of entertainment purpose. Next slide. Robotic act. Uh, robotic acts is all about physical structures, a sequence of links articulated at the joints, kinetic chains to be precise. Next slide. Uh, here, what we have is a SBLP uh, structures. When you Google this, it shows uh, some. A logic programming, a programming languages, something on programming languages uh, that could be precisely robotic programming. Uh, what I have here is is a, a sequence of links, uh, the rotation symbol there shows uh, the moving part. So here the one in the far left in the rotates. So I'll get to the main point later on. The this slide shows two joints or sequence uh, kinetic chains. Uh, the on the far left has two rotation uh, sequences. Um, And the on the far right also have two sequences. Okay, those are the series. Uh, some other examples. 
these are attached to a wall so this shows a vertical uh, robot chain this is for illustrative purposes that also that also and that shows fixed chains this is attached to a polystyrene this shows that another sequence of chains now the rotation degrees here uh, could be anticlockwise or clockwise 90 180 degrees 270 degrees 360 uh, 90 degrees anticlockwise uh, that's in the red the clockwise I own in blue now how do we control the robot that will be done by the computer robot control by computer now autonomous, autonomous behavior is much source of entertainment with several several motor and embedded computer motor can be programmed and controlled next slide a robot manipulator is a sequence of links articulated at joints added autonomous behavior can give you a feel of robotic tax if there's entertainment and can be no tax at all next slide a uh, servo motto is a rotary actuator and or a, a linear actuator that allows for precise uh, control of angular or linear position, velocity, and acceleration. It, cons it consists of a suitable motor coupled to a sensor for position feedback. Source Wikipedia. Next slide. This shows a photo of a servo motor. The connector are two uh, different types of servo motors. Next slide. Now, what is a servo motor? Now this uh, image shows a servo motor with it part label. The motor, the helical uh, GS electrical motor, the warm chair, the 360 GS, we have the output shafts, gear joints, that is another one, uh, the stator, the winding that allow current to flow, the winding to create a rotating magnetic field, bearing, the ball bearing. Now the shafts transmit the motor output power the load is driven through the shaft mechanism. The rotor here is a high function rear or other permanent magnetic magnet in position to external uh, external to the shaft. The encoder, the motor cable, and the encoder cable for computer connections and control. Next slide, embedded computer. And you know, you know, is an open source microcontroller board based on micro microchip AT Mega 328P microprocessor and developed by Arduino. Uh, the board is equipped with uh, sets of digital and analog input or output pins uh, that may be interfaced with various expansion boards or other circuits wikipedia next slide this shows a photo of an arduino uh, microcontroller 
I have two of them here. They zoom in. This, you know, I do know, you know, I have three product. Next slide. This is a, a Tinker Kit Brasil. Uh, this robot is built by Adeno. It has an uh, embedded computer made of Adeno, you know. Now the Tinker uh, Kit Brasil is a fully operational robotic arm uh, controlled via Adeno. It can be assembled in several ways uh, for multiple tasks, uh, such as moving objects. You can also attach a camera or solar panel. There are so many ways in which the Brasil can extend the range, the range, range of your devices. Next slide. Autonomous robot, intelligent robotics. Next slide. Now here, an entertainment robot is, as it, as the name indicates, a robot that is not made for unitarian use, uh, as in production or domestic services, but for the sole subjective uh, pleasure of the human. Robotics technologies are much in many areas of culture and entertainment. Next slide. Uh, this shows some robot entertainment system, uh, toys. I zoom in. Next slide. That also is a robot dog as it shows. I zoom in. Next slide. That is another robot for entertainment. Next slide. That is another robot for entertainment. I hope you appreciate the beauty of this robot. Next slide. Now this is captured from Robot Shop Entertainment Robots. At least on this trip, are the, the fires flaring? Is that in the, uh, the second robot showing uh, some kind of spiritual 
so so body and so in one piece so I'm quite a, a robot that you can tame in there the first looks like a quality movie kind of entertainment robot quite a good posture okay next line this is google source 2021 top 10 robots this is from Asino, Asimo uh, that called Pepe Pepe is a very uh, good example of an entertainment robot this is R2D2 Robot top 10 robots Google source 2021. That is a Ibo dog robot for determining. Now we are on the main points. What are the main points? for this live presentation let's slide now the first bullet indicates that a topic in general interest to robotics the relationship between joints and degrees of freedom uh, the second bullet 10 is on uh, it, its infancy as a technology the technological area of advancement. The third bulletin is an introduction to robotics. The fourth point, the robots are programmable tools, is indication for entertainment. This slide shows robot and manufacturers at present. The first bulletin is ABB, uh, the second bulletin is ADEPT, the third is down, so the fourth is absent. The fifth bullet is Manok. The C is Motoman. The seven is Motoman. Oh, sorry, the seven is Nachi. Eight is Res. Nine, Stably. These are robot manufacturers. Next slide. Now, in the indication of the, kin uh, the kinetics chains or sequence of joints, links with actuators, in design uh, a robot, the following are the specifications that one needs to look out for. Uh, Javier, the first bullet is dimensions, the second is weight. I will explain that later on. The third is payload. The fourth is workspace. Fifth is range of a joint motion. Six, control accuracy. Seven, repeatability. Eight, durability. Nine, reliability. Next slide. Now here the robot weight uh, of overall robot can be an important factor in applications that require the robot be more frequently robot weight next slide on this slide the size of the robot indicates the size of the robot determined by dimensions of its link and its mechanical structure size of robot next slide the workspace consists of volume of space that the robot can reach with its any effector workspace next slide on command does the robot move to its particular position with its tool uh, that is a question of accuracy accuracy next slide 
repeatability concerns repeatability concerns the robot ability to repeat con recorded sense readings from a storage Re repeatability next slide what is re reliability it talks about mean time between uh, failures which is the average time that the robot spends on uninterrupted work without requiring repair or maintenance that is all about reliability reliability next slide now the future of robotics the future of robotics indicates past robot designs in entertainment uh, robotic uh, and robot entertainment uh, present of robotics uh, and the future which is in the extended of the present past present future next slide now we indicated kinetic change uh, uh, static uh, so attaching ties to some of these kinetic chains and driven around like bicycle or other vehicle is another thing to do workshop next slide now this is about autonomy in the above design the designs are fixed kinetic chains uh, it's about that's robotics so the entertainment part is to add autonomy to make it move in the directions as is specified repeatability next slide now machinery of design with uh, sufficient intelligence to make rational decisions within a dynamic environment next slide this is on the use of cost-effective material in body design and chains next slide now the kinetic chains concerns robotics and they are designed to evolve quickly next slide uh, that's the end of the presentation thanks for attending and check for updates from Capia with KCL Center of robotics thank you for your time and good afternoon